What's up, Maniacs? Let's go over what we got in all of these packages. Most of these are going to be, in fact, actually, all of these are going to be aesthetic mods. So they're going to change the look of the car. Not how, uh, how it operates, but just the looks. If you want to see somebody who mods their Mini to change the performance and the handling and stuff like that, check out Manic Motorhead's YouTube video. He's got some great stuff on air suspension and tuning and cold air intakes and things like that. But for me, I'm just going after aesthetics. I want to be able to turn my car back to stock as quickly as possible in hopes that one day I can trade it in for the GP3. No idea if I'm going to get one, but I want to keep my car as close to stock uh, as possible so that I can very quickly in the weekend turn it back um, by undoing those aesthetic changes and put it back to stock so I can trade it in for hopefully a GP3. That's a pipe, that could be a pipe dream or a long shot, but I'd like to uh, take a shot at it. So that's why my mods are mostly just aesthetic mods, nothing to do with tuning or uh, any performance uh, changes like that. So yeah, let's open up some of these boxes and see what we got inside. Whoa, what have we here? This is a pleasant little surprise. 2019 mini calendar. I did not expect that at all, so sweet. Thank you, Mini of Bedford. That's awesome. I'm gonna hang that up for sure. Looks like they also threw in a lanyard some, and some stickers. We got another box inside. Let's see what's inside this. Comes nicely packaged. If I had opened it the right side up. Yeah, there it is. A little dusty from the packaging, but yeah, this is the piano black gas cover. It is not wrapped, it is not chrome, it is in fact piano black stock. So yeah, uh, if you remember, if you've seen, I've done a vinyl wrap, that was my first vinyl wrap attempt um, on the gas cap, and it came out okay from a distance. You can't notice anything, but when you get up close and you look at the edges, you can see my wrap doesn't quite go all the way to the edge. So this will look, or it'll look the same, but it'll feel really, uh, really nice and premium, like it was meant to be for me. So yeah, that's the packaging for that comes like that so yeah look for a future video on uh, taking we're, we're gonna unwrap the uh, chrome gas cap and uh, just take it off and replace it with this piano block one. subscribe for that one next we got two small boxes they're identical open one up take it out it is a piano black door handle. Same idea, we're gonna remove the covers off those chrome ones and we're gonna attempt to put on uh, these piano black ones. And I say attempt because, I don't know if you can see that, but these have the comfort access button. My car does not have the comfort access button. I did not like the aesthetics of the comfort access button on the chrome where you could see that little dot. Um, but I asked the uh, dealers and they said they only sold these piano black ones with the comfort access button. So we're gonna try and install them. Um, I don't think the comfort access button will work and I don't care if it doesn't work as long as the door handles work. I'll just deal with the blank button to get that nice uh, quality piano black look. So yeah, two door handles, one driver's side, one passenger side in piano black. Next we'll open this big box right here. I think you're seeing a theme here. Piano black everything. Let's take a guess at what's inside here. <laughs> This is going to be a video or two, I'm sure. Piano Black Grill. It's going to look way better than that cover, uh, black cover I have, which doesn't quite fit in the corner. Uh, I'll show you, uh, I'll show you that when we replace it. But yeah, this will be uh, probably the biggest replacement job that we'll have to do in the amount, terms of amount of work and bolts and things we got to remove off the car in order to install this. So yeah, subscribe for this one. This one's going to be a doozy, I think. Last but not least, small box from Craven Speed. Let's see what's inside. And this is our first mod for the Countryman. It's a cell phone holder. Um, it's gonna mount, I'm sure you've seen these online before, it mounts right behind the tack uh, and uh, holds your phone, squeezes it in place. So yeah. Check out a video for that in the future. Subscribe so you don't miss that one as well. It's our first video on the Countryman that, we've, uh, that we're going to do. 
because it's the first model in the country we're going to do. So that's it for this one. It's just an update of what's coming in the future on the channel. Uh, thank you for sticking with me while I wait for some parts to come in. I'm still doing some coding research to try and answer everybody's coding questions. Not a coding expert, but I'm going to try and figure them out for you. So there sounds like some interesting things that I'd like to do with my F56 as well. And yeah, I will leave a link in the description where I got all of these parts from. Uh, yeah, how about these guys? Me and Bedford sending a free calendar. That's sick. Um, so yeah, check it out. Subscribe. Ask questions. Leave comments. Don't forget to wave. I'll catch you guys in the next one.